recording uh uh Gary how about, how about live, live streaming recording but how about live streaming just a moment uh, let me try to adjust certain things on the back end my my apologies uh 谢谢大家等待不好意思因为原因就是我们要用一些live streaming 的东西所以我要confirm一下怎么样 uh, live streaming uh, Gary uh, 现在是 recording 有没有办法做 live streaming 呢 mm. just a moment now we try to see whether can we do live streaming in the backdrop so thank you so much for, oh cannot live stream ma. Okay, just start. Okay, can no problem. Okay, then it's okay. We will just proceed to start. Okay, that's it. Thank you so much, everyone, for waiting because what happened is that there was some uh, connectivity issue. So thank you so much for waiting and for your patience. So we will proceed to start. Uh, we will not do live streaming. We will do proceed to start with the recording. Then Gary will put the video up on a later timing. So not to worry. So uh, welcome once again, welcome to another week of uh, work click challenge challenge uh, then your connection got problem Dennis your connection got problem your your volume is very noisy your your, your background not uh, just not so how bad. come hold on hold on yeah. but I, you, you have I a lot of uh, uh, please yeah yeah, you, you have your your background oh. Yeah, yeah. There was a lot, a lot of yes. You are near to some internet, some some internet. Someone is using the same connection. You 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 have to yourself. Sorry. No, actually, I have internet connection the same as before. And uh, no. Uh, no, 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 no. Your reception got problem. Dennis, Dennis, your reception got problem. Your reception got problem. Everyone is hearing a lot of background noise from you. A lot of people are hearing background noise from you. Okay, Gary, I mute you first. I mute you first. Gary, Gary, listen. I mute you first. There is a lot of background noise from you. You are near to somewhere where there's a lot of internet for, uh, outreach. So I can only hear your sound and a lot of uh, uh, interference up behind. So sorry, let me mute you. Okay, so welcome again, everyone. We come to another week of uh, going to Jalan Jalan Silver Click uh, with Radiant Mask. So today, so today, once again, we, we together with Silver Click Ready Mask, we are going out for Jalan Jalan again to Philippines, specifically Manila. So let us welcome Denise. Dennis, let me just put your video on the spotlight and just make sure that your volume, you are away from any interference. Thank you so much. Hello. Good morning, everyone. Again. Good oh, morning. Can you hear me? Yes. Is yes. The, the audio is clear, I hope? Yeah, it's loud and clear. Very good. Now it's better. Just now was quite bad. Yeah. Okay. I don't know, but maybe before... I was with other students because today uh, we have a lot of school trips. So the school trips actually is beginning now because it's summer, as I told you last time. But uh, we are just past the holy season. So last time we've seen a lot of people because it was the Easter season. But today we might see a lot of actually students going for field trip or learning about something about the Philippine itself. Oh. So we will, we will start. That's the reason why you see here, lot of people. Okay, hold on. Okay, so this week, now we see that are Today, Dennis will bring, will show us another side. So I can see that there's a lot of students out for field trip. Yes, a uh, lot of students for school trip because uh, actually April should be the ending of the school, but because of the pandemia or pandemia, 
uh, we have shifting. So some people will finish now and some will finish in June. Oh, so so now they actually basically is because the school actually has a vacation. So this week, so so basically, many students will come out to play, to learn, to practice. So because of the pandemic, so basically, some students are four months out of school. Some are on holiday. 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 Sorry? It all along is it supposed to be April? Yes. Yes, uh, supposed to be. I supposed see. Supposed to be. <laughs> uh -huh. So um we start our tour actually. Uh, yes, the second yes. part of our tour. And today I will focus mostly on the uh south southwest part of uh Intramuros, which is uh, starting from um Manila Cathedral, okay? I see. So Manila Cathedral is uh, one of the main churches that we have here. That's why I want to start here. Hmm, I see. So we are basically just say we are now is coming to Manila, the other place. So that is to say, ah, here is ah, actually is in Manila. This place is southern part, is southern part. And and we are looking at this this church, actually is Manila, the oldest, the oldest, and the oldest church in Manila. So we are now coming to the Manila Church. So we are now coming to the Manila Church. So we are now coming to the Manila Church. So we are now coming to the Manila Church. So we are now coming to the Manila Church. So we are now coming to the Manila Church. So we are now coming to the Manila Church. Okay, so wow, very beautiful architecture. I can see that. Yes, the architecture of Manila Cathedral actually is a Roman architecture. This is the only one that has Roman architecture. That's the reason why, if you see here, we have the cupola, uh, the rotone, which is let us enter the light that, that rounded there. Okay, and of mm. course, the entrance has three navates, so three corridors. What? Sorry, with, with what? Sorry, can't hear you. Uh, well. When you go inside, the um, the church has three corridors, three main corridors. Oh, okay, okay. That so is why you see three doors in front. I see. So can go go in by any of the doors, is it? Yes. Okay, so here, actually, Manila's this this church is actually is because I was saying they are actually are quite old. So here, you can see their architecture is quite special. So here, we can see that they have three main corridors. 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 Oh, so very, very unique. It's, it looks very European design. This is really very European design. Okay, yes, this is, you are correct. This is very European design. Uh, that's the reason why also uh, is a Romance, Romanic architecture, actually. And that is the unique representative of this architecture here in Manila. 嗯，所以基本上这边这的那个设计理念其实是跟呃欧美人士是有关联的，而且是尤其是罗马，所以你就看到他们好像有一点点像那种啊、呃，你如果你去罗马去啊、呃、游旅游的话，你就看到他们基本上就外面有很多所谓的那些啊啊、呃呃、神像啊这类的，所以是蛮蛮相像的。嗯 ，OK， if you can see， OK， we are still in the front， this is the main door。The central one, but if you see, I'm going after right now. If you see every corner on the roof, we have a pineapple, which is mostly representation of fortune and prosperity in Chinese culture. Oh, very interesting mix, huh? Uh, they have actually got got that one. So, in general, you here, see, it's not just for us to see. It's that in this church, ah. 啊，虽然是欧美人是西式的那种设计，可是你看哦，现在你看到、哦、他们其实有黄梨嘞，啊，在在这个建筑上面，他们其实有黄梨，就是表示出哦，这里真的是有一点点中西和平，就是说华人的那个设计因素跟设计理念都有包括在里。Oh, and I can see the floor is very nice. They have all the stars on the floor, right? The 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 design of the stars. Yes, they have lots of stars on the floor. Uh, this is because uh, this church uh, actually uh, because during pandemic we have to have distance to each other. So each star is one position. 
So Is to that have to keep distance to each other, one, one meter. Oh, wow, that's very beautiful arrangement. So we see, we see, 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 Oh, so interesting. That's, that's a very nice design to do that. It's very, very nice. Yeah. Actually, that, so, was, a, that was a good idea, no? Instead of the bullet point, is they might just a star. Yes. So you can feel every person is a star. <laughs> Social distancing. Social distancing, yes. Social distancing, yes. 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 Yeah, very nice idea. Singapore, Singapore design not so nice. Uh, and the Singapore design all put the yellow black tape. Uh, not very pretty. This one very nice. Mm. Okay, right now I'm pointing. Okay, in front of you, you have like it was the tower. It was the bell tower when it was constructed. This church was constructed in 1571. But uh, of course, that tower there. Um, because of the earthquake collapse and it was like a pagoda before. I see. I'm going to ask a question. Talking about that, I'm going to ask a question. Manila Cathedral was constructed in 1571, right? So how yes. many times was it destroyed? So I, I will go to ask the poll question to everyone. Let them answer. So in Manila, the 他其实被摧毁过几次了，所以你们可以这样讲说，他是有没有被摧毁过，还是摧毁过一次，还是太多次，还是没有摧毁，只是啊升级。So everyone can answer, uh, whether was it uh compared with other church, but not ever destroy or only destroy once or destroy many times or never destroy only renovation. Uh, let them guess. Uh, because sometimes uh, uh, we are all very nice. Often we tell them the answer. I have a lot of uh, poll questions. Sometimes people very smart. So nowadays uh, we want to make sure that they answer the poll question. <laughs> I can see that today is also quite crowded. Uh, even though today is a Thursday afternoon uh, morning. But uh, really can see a lot of students, a lot of people being around here. Oh, that's quite interesting. Okay, now we have around 22 people, uh, 23% out of 38 person who has answered the poll. Let me, 24 person, let me end the poll. Oh, uh, the niche, they are all pretty spread out. No one, I think no one know the correct answer. Let me give you the uh, sharing. So uh, Gary, oh, uh, Denise, you can see that what a number of people think that it's a compile with other church. Some believe that destroy only once, some think that too many times. And majority of people say that it was never destroyed, but only upgrade. So uh, what is the correct answer? Okay, so, so uh, I explain you. Uh, I see the poll. Mm. Hello, okay, yes, yes. and uh, I see there's uh, many answers, but yes. uh, the correct one is uh, too many times. Oh, this many. is, yes, so this is the eighth Manila Cathedral constructed on site. Eight. So it was destroyed eight times, seven times, oh, seven wow. times destroyed, too many. Oh, so so they will destroy how how would they destroy so many times? Okay, I explain you also the reason why. Uh, first of all, uh, the first the first one was constructed in bamboo and palisade. So it was uh, burned by the invasion of the Chinese. Oh,所以第一次他们做的时候，其实是用竹藤去建造，而且呢，而且那时候啊啊，菲律宾跟华人其实是不和睦的，所以啊，他基本上被华人就把那个建那个教堂给摧毁了。That's the first time. Oh, wow. Okay. Okay. So the other several times actually was because many Philippines lay on the ring of fire, so we have many earthquakes. And typhoons. 
啊，所以所以接下来是因为在在菲律宾，其实是在那个所谓的那个地震的那个啊啊火火区，因为地震其实很多国家都有，可是菲律宾就是在那个比较常发生那个地带，所以基本上很多时候就是因为啊自然灾害啊地震呃呃呃呃弄坏的哦。So, okay, also it was destroyed. You remember last time I told you that there's only one building left, and we saw last time. So this one was destroyed during the Second World War. Oh, so the Second World War was also ah, at that time, the soldiers were destroyed. Also, there was also a war. Hmm. Okay. Yes. If you see here, I'm I'm stopped here for several times for a long time because what you are seeing right now. Is the only original part of this church? Oh, oh, the only original part. Okay. Yes. So we now see this. This is giving us this this entrance door. Actually, it's been so many years. They have always changed the so-called Chinese renovation. It's not just the renovation, but it's also changing the shape, changing the size, changing the design, changing the layout, changing the construction. 啊，重建这些哦，因为被摧毁过啊七次嘛。那这里就是只是唯一一个原貌的地方。这里现在我们看到了这个出入口是唯一一个仅留的那个原貌。哦，说说 ，this one is very precious. It's all the way from 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 many many hundred years ago. Yes, 1571 till today, but destroyed different time. 哦，所以这个是从一。一五七一年所保留剩下来的那个那个设计，哇，真的是很宝贵嘞，就就真的是超过了，啊、呃，超过了五百多年，哇 ，so it's more than five hundred years, very very precious, wow. Yeah, okay. Also, in this church was celebrated, ah,、uh, three popes celebrate the mass here. One, it was Pope Paul, Pope John Paul the twenty third, and then Pope Francis is the latest. 哦、oh, ，所以这边其实来到这里啊啊啊，来到这里敬拜的话，其实这里哦，其实有很多教皇来过。那因为因为马尼拉，我们啊菲律宾，我们就懂他们其实是天，多数人是天主教嘛，所以他们其实那个教皇那个 p 其实有来过马马尼拉，来到这所教堂。三次，所以啊啊、呃呃，随着世世纪，随着时时代的变迁，其实有三个教皇都来过这个这个这个教堂这样子啊，因为他因为是天主堂啊，天主教嘛。So wow, so that's quite impressive because you have three popes that came over before. That's that's really very very impressive. Yes, three popes actually celebrate here the ah、uh, the mass. Okay.、Mm. But、uh, in this area, which is called Plaza Roma, and you see this one, it's a it's a square, it's a big square、yes. that you see lots of children right now. Yes.、Uh, we have other two important buildings because this was the center of the Spanish during the Spanish period. Oh, so you can see this this so-called that center point. You can see that the church outside the church outside the church outside the church. 其实是这个这个在那个西班牙统治的时候占领的时候，这里其实就是他们的中间中间地段这样子。Oh, so this is actually the central of everything during the Spanish occupation. Yes. So during the Spanish occupation,、uh, at that time, so 1500, we don't have newspapers yet here in Philippines. So. All the news from the Spain coming with the galleon, so the crews when come here, the merchant used to give all the information what's happening in Mexico and in Spain. That's the reason why this square actually was where you take all the information coming from Spain or what's happening in Spain. Ah, so this side is basically they are they are Spanish people. Ah, the point is, for example, you want to hear some Spanish news or something like that. Because in the olden days, ah, 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 ah
呃一五零呃一呃一六零零啊一七零零啊一七八零零那个时代，他们基本上是没有报纸的，所以他们呢、哦，如果要交换消息的话，要西班牙消息的话，他们就会集合在这边。哦 ，so this is like the gathering point. Okay, shall we continue move on from here? Yeah. Yes. If you see here. Yes. Okay. We have Palacio del Gobernador, which is Spanish words, the Governor Palace. So you see, it's the center. We have the church, we have the Governor Palace, and on the other side, that building in the white is the Ayuntamiento, where you pay the taxes. Ah, okay. So, in general, we can see that this is really the center of the city. Because you can see that just now, we have the church, then the Governor Palace, and on the other side, the Governor Palace. Then, on the other side, the Governor Palace. Then, on the other side, the Governor Palace. Then, on the other side, the Governor Palace. 高的那个楼，其实就是说他们的所谓的啊，故宫，他们的那个皇宫之类的啦，啊，所以是在西班牙统治的时候，刚刚那白色的那个建筑就是基本上是他们还税的地方，所以这里是他们的中心点。嗯 ，OK，OK，、okay. okay, so that's the that's the ayuntamiento, and in the middle we have one statue representing King Charles the Fourth, and he is a good King for us because he brought the vaccine of the chicken box and、oh. saved lots of wife、uh, lives. Oh, okay. So, so they actually, is to say, in this side, you see a a ah image, a image, like we bring the Buddha image. They are here a image. But in this image, this image is to celebrate Charles the Fourth. Charles the Fourth. 他们那边那个啊啊统治国的，那基本上就是他为什么他们会纪念他呢？是因为那时候我们有所谓那个 chicken box 嘛，所以基本上啊没有疫情啊没有那个疫苗，所以出水痘嘛，他基本上就是他带来那个啊解除水痘的这个方法带进来啊菲律宾，所以他们就非常纪就纪念他的那个。Ah,、uh, ah,、uh, function. Hmm. So, oh, that's very interesting. So he actually brought in the vaccine for chicken pox. Hmm. Very, very unique. So today, today, this area actually is very common for students because they come here to rest. Also, ah,、uh, there are Filipino coming here for during the break time of their office. But mostly, this park is open plenty. During Saturday and Sunday, because on this church, Manila Cathedral, there's a lot of weddings during Saturday and Sunday. Ah, so, uh, so over here, what you can see is that, ah, 这边其实就是说，呃，他们其实有很多人都会来到这里，因为除了是个很大的一个一个一个空地，他们可以来这里聚集。那基本上是因为也是周末的时候。在这里的教堂，其实他们会举办许多的婚礼，因为都讲了这个教堂是在菲律宾马尼拉是算是其中一个规模最大以及最古老的那个教堂，所以其实是很多人来这里去结婚了，举办婚礼。Oh, so cute! The horse with the carriage, so cute. So people are still travel around in in in.、So, uh, Yes. yes. Yeah. Actually, uh, the best way to visit Intramuros is with the Kalesa, the original one, uh, that can go around of Intramuros. So this one, it was the car during the 16th century. Oh, so basically, we see the car. The car is basically the one that was used in the 16th century. It was the most popular way of traveling. They would usually use the car to enter this place. Actually, this place, oh, we are going to go to this place is called Intramuros. That is to say, their Roman city. 他们的王城区就是啊、呃、最古老的那个啊、呃、市市区这样子，所以所以是啊啊、呃呃、所谓的城堡了，应该这样子讲。嗯 ，So now we are 啊、uh, careful 啊 ，careful。We are now going working. Yeah, continue. Going to the next uh top that is even more interesting because that is the first fortress made by the Spaniard. Here in Manila. So, basically, we are going to the Roman city. Ah, the Roman city. The other, the other side. 
。所以其实在这边完成区有许多的东西可以看得到。Can can can see that there's a lot of things that is quite interesting in in Ramuros. Yeah. So going here, actually Port Santiago, which is our next stop, uh, is the main fortress that was constructed in 1571 by the Spanish. However, it was existing even before where Muslims were the boss or were the dominant here. Ah, I see. So, in this case, we are going to go to this Fort San Diego. This is actually their famous Fort San Diego. Fort San Diego is actually many people who think it was constructed by Roman people. 啊，不是西班牙人是而建成的。其实他就跟我们分享，其实，在那个时代之前，其实已经有什么所谓的回教徒在在在菲律宾了，所以是他们所所也是在在这这里那时候已经是蛮蛮多的那个回教徒了。哦，所以所以 ，that's mean even before the the Spanish were here, there were already a lot of Muslim around the uh Philippines itself. Okay, I think Dennis have a bit of an internet connection issue. Dennis, just want to ask a question. So Fort Santiago, uh, the first Fort Santiago was constructed in 1571. Uh, okay, I think there's Hello. some... Yes, yes. Yes, coming back. Coming back and forth. I don't know why, but here the signal is 5, 5G. Sorry, Dennis, what, what, what are you saying? Okay. We we are we are in front of Port Santiago now. Okay. Ah, we are now in front of the San Diego Fort. In San Diego Fort, the that 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 So Dennis, not be ah Dennis, your internet connection seems to be a bit lagging. Yeah. So never mind. I'll take it over just in case you can step in if you have ah uh, ah uh, yeah, information. Yeah. Or, or so, yeah. We will go inside and we will be. Okay. Can no problem. Yeah. Just be careful. Yeah. Just be careful. Do okay. you have problem with connection? Yes, I have problem with connection. Yes. Uh, I think it's not mine by the way because. Last yesterday I was here and doing the video with a friend of. Yeah, but I think today connection is not good because everyone is looking at your connection. And the uh, the connection. Yeah, but but uh but uh Dennis, so, I, Dennis, I think your connection got some problem because everyone is looking at your connection, so we can see yes. your. Connection. Yeah, so not to worry, not to worry. You continue walk. Uh, continue share. I will just add in. A because start rate. Start start training actually. So, sorry, wait, wait, it's, wait. Because it's start training and we have typhoon, coming typhoon. Oh, maybe wait, signal wait. is not good. <laughs> yeah, maybe, maybe. So it's in Japan, in the Philippines, Manila, here, actually, uh, they also say that there will be a typhoon, it will be very strong, and some of the phones will be very strong. Those TVs and the internet lines will actually be affected. I I can understand that because sometimes when I go Philippines, Manila, uh, the internet connection when there's typhoon, earthquake, and of course, uh, stronger winds, uh, it happens because. I know that a lot of connectivity has has sometimes has some problem, yeah. So so let's talk let's talk about uh Fort San Diego a bit more. So Fort San Diego, I know that uh is actually uh uh is a preserved uh place right now still still preserved by the government. Uh yes, actually is preserved by the Intramuros administration. Oh. And the uh, this one was destroyed also during the World War II completely, and oh. only one part is remain original, which is the main entrance. Oh, also the same like the Manila Cathedral. Oh, so in general, we are now going to this place. This place, 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 this
啊、呃，唯一所保留的就是他们基本上现在是用那个环城区，他们是来保护这个地方。那基本上它也是像啊、呃，刚才我们讲的那个马尼拉的那个教堂，它其实是有很多被损坏。那唯一个没被损坏的地方啊、呃，就是说啊、呃，是在。啊、呃，它的那个出入口一样，就是也是在出入口才没有被损坏。Yeah, Denise, you might want to walk faster over to let us see the the place because yes. especially your internet connection is really not good. Ah,、uh, at the moment, yeah. Okay, just be careful, I just try to. Yeah, yeah. Just be careful. Just just be safe. So, ah,、uh, our friend Xiaoxi Denise 就会跟我们帮忙我们走的过去快一点，因为原因就是他的那个网络有点点小弱，所以就担心，因为你们有我在，所以其实说这个这个啊宝其实是非常的重要，因为基本上我去过马尼拉好几次了，我去马尼拉至少个五六次吧。啊，我历史其实去过很多次，我改次也可以做一个 ，maybe 或许找一个马尼拉的啊老公嘛去那边找啊，所以那边其实是说他们这个地方其实就跟我们比如说欧欧洲的那个罗马有点小相同，就是因为基本上有非非常多西班牙统治时代所统治的那时候那些地方，而且他们基本上都保存的非常好。非常的优美，就他们，因为他们是西班牙统治嘛，所以基本上他们的建筑特色跟西班牙，你你去西班牙或者去啊、呃、罗马，去去欧美那个国家都是相同的，就是他们很多就是在啊十十六世纪、十五世纪啊这些所保留呃下来的。那那新加坡其实就没有像他们这么多的那些比较旧的那个那个啊啊。呃呃城市这样子，所以其实是他们真的是蛮蛮厉害的。说、so, 他们那边有很多东西，他们都保留的很好。So always always in 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 Manila, you will realize that there's a lot of things in Manila that is actually very very well protected. Because I have been to Manila for for five six times at least, and uh I know that everywhere in Manila, especially the older buildings, they actually protect it very well. Like for example. Ah,、uh, they will make sure that ah,、uh, like ah,、uh, those especially during the Spanish ah、uh, colonization period, ah,、uh, when it was part of the Spanish management, ah,、uh, a lot of such buildings they are all preserved and ah、uh, and, and conserved because of the very interesting ah、uh, architecture design. In fact, yeah, I often tell people if you go to Manila, ah ah ah, go to Manila, you feel that you are being taken back. A few hundred years ago, because of the architecture. So, basically, if you're in Malaya, Manila, walking, walking, you find that some places you feel like, hey, you live in ah, one thousand five hundred years, one thousand seven hundred years, because some places are still a bit ah, more so called ah, old or old or ancient feeling. That kind of feeling. So, still, still has that feeling. Oh, Denise, have you managed to go to the location? Let me just book you back. Can you see the location? Yeah, I will book you back into Spotlight. Ah,、uh, so that okay. everyone can actually. I'm really sorry. Sometimes there are area that is not good. But yesterday、no、I was here.、No、I、worries. was here, and I did the same tour with a friend of mine just to 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 check which internet is was working. And this morning I bought another SIM card because it was ah、uh, yesterday yesterday morning、uh -huh. I bought another SIM card because it's stronger than the other one. That's the、no、first、worries. time I checked. Yeah, no worries, Dennis. It's hap it happens because even in Singapore, sometimes I go to that place just one hour earlier, and one hour later the internet got problem because sometimes maybe just nice the wind is stronger. A lot of people are using the internet around, so the internet might be not so good. So not to worry. So is this the only original structure that is left behind?、Yeah. Oh, so、what? I will just turn. Because we see what you have, we left behind. No, okay. Fort Santiago is actually、uh, divided in three main parts. The main fortress is on our back that you see before, and this one is the Plaza Moriones. Oh, so that's our Macan. Can we have a look at the building again? Can we just turn around? Let them see the original、Hello? building again. 
yeah, just turn around the camera. Thank you so much. So, in the end, now we see that the body needs to be rejuvenated. 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 So now we can proceed to walk off. Thank you so much. Oh, beautiful, beautiful. I love it. Yeah, I can really see okay. that uh, the architecture is very nice. Yes. So you see the main the main gate over there. Okay. Before the main gate, we have the water here. Mm. And this is called the moat. Because before, uh, the moat was to protect the all intramuros. So the moat here is just a representation and to separate what belongs to the Filipino to the main fortress. Ah, I see. So you see, but since you can see that, ah, in the wall outside, ah, you can see that, ah, there is a one, 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 或许去攻打的话，基本上这个护城河就可以避，就可以拖延时间。就是那些人如果要打仗要打进去的话，他们要基本上要有桥过，或者要游泳过去，就会延误一点点时间。所以这个叫做护城河。Well, very nicely designed moat, very beautiful design moat. Okay, so this here, that's the bridge from the moat. Actually, it was constructed elevated one. Uh, by the Spanish, but uh, during the American period, they improved it. Ah, so basically, they also have been repaired. This bridge, they also have been repaired once. Because, as I said earlier, here in the Philippines, there is a tsunami, a earthquake, so there is a Oh, so very interesting. Mm. So over there you see a, um, a net. That net, it was mowed before and right now is a golf course. Oh, golf course. <laughs> okay, so we are going to look at the golf course in the video. The golf course is the golf course. Actually, the golf course is the golf course. The golf course is the golf course. But now we are going to make the golf course into a golf course. We are going to make the golf course into a golf course. 高高尔夫球场那个地方，哎呦 ，so incredible， but but it's quite sad to become a a golf course outside the the intramurals. <laughs> it, it is safe because actually there's a lot of net to protect intramurals inside. Oh, okay, okay, that's okay. good. On the other uh, side, instead, you see all those buildings. Yes. Okay, those buildings actually belongs already to the first Chinatown in the world. Oh, so we see that these high tower, these are actually the world's first and the oldest ah Tang Ren Jie, is in that area. Because many people may think that it's Tang Ren Jie, Tang Ren Jie, ah, many places have it. But you know, the Philippines is one of the first Tang Ren Jie in the world, the oldest Tang Ren Jie. That means that we have many Chinese people who have moved to different places, right? Philippines is the first Tang Ren Jie. So I was just sharing them that really because uh, I remember when I go to uh, Binodo, I was uh, I was surprised because I didn't know that uh, over there is actually the first Chinatown in the whole world. So very, very impressive. So I think that uh, a lot of people, a lot of our audience will be very surprised too. Oh, very beautiful design. I love the the the. the Building architecture. Wow. Okay, so that design actually they are the theme of the Castilla or the Spain. So you see the crown at the very top. Okay, mm. and then you have the lion and the castle. Okay, because the two family, the family castle, which is Castilla, and the Leon family, they were the two strongest family. Mm. Together, they united and formed the reign of Spain. 嗯，所以这边你们就看到他们的那个那个设计，就是说在那个西班牙统治国的那个设计，就是说有一个皇冠以及他们的家
加冕，所以就是说，基本上就是说，那个时候那个时代，哪一个哪一个国哪哪一个家庭 ，OK， 他们比如说皇族还是什么之类的啊，比较强而有力，他们基本上就可以把他们的那个啊家家庭的那个啊。啊，设计就可以放在上面，就好像我们比如说那个家徽啦，就可以放在上面。就好像我们新加坡那个 c a v e r n a c h Bridge， 他们也是把那个啊家徽放在那边的。c a v e r n a c h Bridge 你们应该是比较懂吧？就是新加坡的那个啊最古老的那个啊加纳桥那边，他们也是有这个家徽。嗯 ，so very interesting that they put the family crest over here. 嗯 ，Okay, so here down, this is like A leaf or a flower, right? Yes. That is the nilad. Is the name of the flower, and the name my nilad is because there is this flower. The formation of my or marame. There's a lot of this flower before in Philippines, so they called my nilad, and right now it's manila. Oh, so interesting. So now we see this flower has a little flower scent. 设计其实就是说马尼拉花，那其实真正他们应该是读音是叫马啊马尼拉，所以说其实是那个名字是这样子写啊叫的。可是因为随着时代变迁，他们就把那个字改了，把那个方式，所以就叫做马尼拉花。所以也就是说 ，Is that the reason why it's called Manila? Yes, that is the reason why it's called Manila. The reason is my there is. Nilad, which is the name of the flower. Hmm. So Manila, actually, is 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 Mm. And uh, then they make it with the volcanic stuff or volcanic stone. And these are the volcanic stone. Ah, so basically, the first time they did it, they used the wood they did, but it was thrown away. So now they used the stone that was made out of the volcanic rock. So it was constructed. So it was quite durable, quite durable. Oh, very nice. Okay. So uh, you know. How they make the glue at the time? It was made by the white of the eggs. Oh, so using egg white. So they basically, that volcanic rock, that they how they make it? They basically use our white powder, use our white powder. We eat that powder. Okay. 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 Okay.
But I heard that there's an urban legend. Is that so? Correct. Uh, that should be my next question. And yes. there's some urban legends. You know, in all the worlds, there's urban legends, right? Yes. So these urban legends coming from maybe true stories or maybe in yeah, your internet has some problems, so let me help you to answer the question. So, urban legend that are monster with a uh, there story were... to make fun that are coming from the story. Yeah, so everyone can actually poll. Uh, you can actually answer because there are urban legend that there are monster with a shape of one body and two heads appearing on the sunset on top in Tremoros. So what are those monsters? So in general, it's all legends. Say, 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 or is it the last dragon in the world? So, so I in view of the time, I will stop the poll very quickly. So I will share the result. Uh, Dennis, what is the answer? Okay, the answer actually. They are students, lovers, hugging each other. So when they <laughs> hug each other, they have two heads and only one body. Ready,反正的答案是互相拥抱的学生恋人，因为他们在夕阳西下的时候，他们会去这里啊，趴拖啦，基本上他们会来这里趴拖。那他们来这里趴拖的时候，就会拥抱嘛，拥抱你就只可
，有点像莱佛士酒店哦，这样的感觉哈、哦，会不会啊？你们有没有这个小小的感觉？有点像莱佛士酒店的那个附近，嗯。Okay. Although you show the the picture before, no, I have another story for you. You、okay. know, the Philippines has so so、uh, many islands, no? Yes. That they discovered in 1980s one island, defended by one Japanese. Okay, it was in 1986, and the war was ended, and he was still、um, fighting for the Japanese. He thought that the、uh, the World War Two didn't end in 1944. So till 1986, he was defending the island alone. Oh, and who was that person? And it was one Japanese. Oh, one Japanese that defending、yeah. the the island. Oh, okay. So so, 基本上，菲律宾其实是。啊、uh, ，有非非常多非常多的那个啊啊、uh, uh, 群岛，那基本上就是他就在开始跟我们分享，就是说啊， uh, 很特别，就是其实，在菲律宾的这个这个历史其实里面，其实有一部分的历史其其实是日有一个日本人帮忙保护菲律宾的，有一段时期是一啊、uh, 一啊、uh, ，I think what ah which year I think I think what year I think like this。Eighteen nine nineteen eighty six one nine eight six one nine eight six. Do you win? Ah, it's starting from the end of World War Two. Ah, so they, they actually say that the Japanese, they just basically is ah after the World War Two, ah they just continue to protect this place until ah 1986. Hmm, very interesting. Yes, it's very interesting. Yes, it's very interesting. Yes, it's very interesting. Uh, the image or the statue, or our national hero, Doctor Jose Rizal. Oh, so we now see that the ah 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 country, to say, actually is very important person. So this actually is basically their ah ah very famous ah person. So this is their Jose Rizal. So if you don't know, he is actually is ah ah in the Philippines. 来讲是啊，非常啊，非呃，有人的那个声音，声音要要小心哦啊，所以他是在啊，菲律宾来讲是啊，非英雄人物啦，就是他们的那个啊，何塞利亚啊，这样子，就是对他们来讲是国国宝级的那个英雄人士，嗯。So this is the place where he spent his last night、oh. before going to the execution ground. Okay, so basically, just this place, so I saw that is that he was in the process of being killed before being shot. So he was in the process of being shot. So he was in the process of being shot. So he was in the process of being shot. So he was in the process of being shot. So he was in the process of being shot. So he was in the process of being shot. Mm, so very very interesting. Yes, he was considered a national hero because actually he was the one who started thinking that the Philippines belongs to Filipinos and not to the Spanish because、mm. he was he won in Spain and so the behavior of the Spanish. I see. So he he basically became the so-called national hero because he felt that ah we ah Philippines. 不应该继续被啊、呃、西班牙人统治，或者任何人统治。菲律宾人应该只由菲律宾人统治，就是来管理。那基本上他就对抗了许多的那些政治人物啊，就对抗了许多的那个战争啊，就对抗那些啊侵略者。所以也就是因为这样子，他就成为了菲律宾啊、呃、的国家英雄。Mm, so very interesting. So thank you so much, Denise. I think that today we actually learned a lot from you. We saw a lot of things so, so, from you. So I thank you so much, Denise, for today because I I can see that now it's already eleven a.m. I think that you、yeah. also sitting on. So once again, thank you so much, Denise, for everything shown today. So we're going to. 非常感谢 Danny 今天带我们所玩的那个地方啊、uh, ，走走的。Yeah, thank you thank so much, you. Danny. I see you next week. Thank you so much, Barbara. Is also thank you. So, so we exit.
we exit right now because yeah, we yeah. We end it right now. We okay. end it. Yeah. So Thank just you. be careful. Just be see careful. you next week. Yeah, see you next week. Thank you so much, uh, uh, Dennis. So we are going to meet with Dennis and say bye bye. He is very kind. He 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 发到群主那边，所以啊、呃，你们那个 QR 码不用担心，他会啊、呃、把那个啊、呃、QR 码发去群主。So for everyone else, just take note. Today we don't have the QR code for Passion Card because Gary is actually unwell today. So 啊、uh, ，he will send the QR code to the group chats later. So today you just take note of the group chats. He will send the the QR code to the ah、uh, to to everyone who earn the passion card points. Okay. So once again, thank you so much, everyone. Thank you, thank you so much, Audi. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. We'll see you next week. Okay. Bye bye. Bye bye. Thank you, everyone. Thank you so much. Bye bye. Bye bye. Okay, Audi. Bye bye. Bye bye. See you next week. Bye bye. Bye bye. Thank you.